Hey guys, it's Carson Mullen Tech here, back with another video. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to manually take off and land with a DJI drone. Now I'm gonna be flying my DJI Phantom 3 standard as always, but that doesn't really matter because this should apply to all DJI drones and possibly other drones out there that aren't made by DJI. So you may be wondering to yourself, well, why would you wanna take off manually when you can just click the little button on the DJI Go app and it will take off and land for you? Well, honestly, to me, I believe it's just a preference thing, but there are some times where possibly you may need to manually land because the DJI Go app is funky or something like that. So yeah, uh, personally, I just manually land and take off because I just like that better than clicking the button on the app. Anyways, guys, uh, now that that has all been said, let's get into how you actually do this. All right, so once you've got your controller on, your drone on, and you're connected via the DJI Go app, then there are two different ways that you can actually take off manually. I suggest choosing one way and just always sticking with it as that makes it simplest. But the two ways that you can take off manually are putting the controls out all the way and holding them there or pushing them into the center. This is called the CSC command and you can take off really either way and it doesn't really matter. Hold up, I actually never mentioned this in the video, but I just wanna say right now that if you do the same exact thing up in midair, uh, guess what? Your drone will be falling from the sky. So I would highly suggest not doing this CSC command in the air or you will be down your drone. So I'll be demonstrating both right here, right now. So first I'm going to do the one that I always choose. As you can see, once it actually starts the motors, then you're going to have to push up on your left stick or whatever stick is the throttle for height. So then the second way, like I was saying, to actually take off, which I rarely do this way, but you can do it this way as well. So put it to the outside. As you can see, turns on the drone also. And same thing, you have to just push up on the left stick to take off. So after you're done flying around and taking awesome shots with your drone, you wanna bring it down and actually land. So to do that manually, it's pretty simple. To bring it down, you obviously, you just pull down the left stick and it will slowly begin coming down to the ground. Once you actually get down to the ground, as you can see, pulling down the left stick, not entirely, but just to this point, the motors will still stay on, but to actually shut it off, you need to pull down the left stick all the way until it locks in. So, as you can see there, just locked in, and then that shuts off the motors. So there you go, you have now manually taken off and landed your DJI drone without any use of the DJI Go app. So anyways guys, that's pretty much it for this short little video. I hope it helped you out. If it did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you'd like to see future videos from me, make sure to click that subscribe button down below. And also while you're at it, turn on notifications because I randomly live stream sometimes and you may not want to miss that. Also check out my last video up there and some random drone video down there. So yeah guys, that is it for this video. See you guys in the next video. Peace. Oh, a drone is coming in fast.